Hello, I'm Jana from English Buff. You know, the English language may sometimes seem a bit confusing. There are some words that sound or look the same and yet have completely different meanings. It's some kind of a trap for English learners. In this lesson today, I'm going to share some pairs of words that are often confused. Words like maybe and maybe, then and then, it's and it's, excess and excess, beside and besides. A bit confusing, huh? But no worries, we're going to go into the matter right here, right now in this lesson. So no more waiting, let's get started. Maybe is an adverb that means the same as perhaps or probably. Maybe it will stop raining. Maybe no one will come to the party. Maybe as two separate words. May is a modal verb that indicates the probability. So maybe is the same as is possible. He may be late. She may be waiting for a bus. It's is short for it is or it has. It's cold outside is the same as it is cold outside. It's been cold for three days, the same as it has been cold for three days. It's without the apostrophe is a possessive pronoun which means belonging to it. I can see its tail, which means cat's tail. The city has decorated all of its official buildings. Then is used to show differences or make comparisons. Elephants are bigger than mice. Peter is more intelligent than Robert. Then is used to indicate a point of time. It means the same as next or afterwards. Go straight ahead, then turn right. Work hard and then rest. Access means entry, admission or approach. It can be both a noun and a verb. The only access to the village is by boat. Can you help me to access the file on the computer? Excess means something that is more than enough or even too much. The excess tickets to the concert were sold for a few dollars each. We sent some excess food home with grandpa. Beside is a preposition that means next to or very close to, and it's rather formal. Would you put it on the table beside the desk? Besides is a preposition or a linking word that means in addition to or also. What other types of music do you like besides classical? It's quite cold and besides, it's getting late. Don't forget to put commas here. Okay, well, I hope you found that useful. I've made a worksheet which you can download and practice so that you can make sure that you are using these words correctly. If you like this video, then please let me know. Like it and write me in comments. That's it from me today. Subscribe if you haven't already and if you want to keep watching some more English video lessons. Bye for now.